Hey everybody, Pastor Boyle here from Revival Baptist Church of both the Orlando and Jacksonville area. And I just wanted to give a quick update with the stay at home orders for the state of Florida and start off by saying that church services are going to continue as usual. And for that, I want to thank the governor of the state of Florida, uh, Governor Ron DeSantis. Um, he issued an executive order and uh, stating that we are at a stay at home order, um, but I have it with me and um, I'm excited by the wording that he chose because under section three, it says essential activities. For purposes of this order and the conduct is limits, essential activities means and encompasses the following. Very first one, attending religious services conducted in churches, synagogues, and houses of worship. So he's allowing uh, and actually calling our assembling together essential during this time of crisis. And so I'm just uh, excited to know, I thought it was essential. I'm sure the Lord thought it was essential when he told us not to forsake the assembling. But now even the governor has deemed that attending services in church is an essential part of society. And then he also said this in section four, it says, Section four, local orders in response to COVID-19. This order shall supersede any conflicting additional, I'm sorry, any conflicting official action or order issued by local officials in response to COVID-19. So Jacksonville, the mayor has said that churches cannot meet, but the governor said that the issue he just issued today, this mandate will supersede any local officials in their regulation. So with that said, we are gonna full, have full services both here and in Jacksonville. And so we're excited that, that the Lord has given us this liberty once again, and uh, we've just decided to keep going. Now with that said, we're gonna change some approaches a little bit just to you know qu uh, quiet some fear that may be out there. Our soul winning practices are gonna change, so make sure you get with your group leaders on that. But we've also come up with this table and we made a banner and it says praying or prayer for your health. And we're gonna set these up at places that the government deems essential like grocery stores, supermarkets, um, gas stations, uh, pharmacies. And it's gonna be a table manned by two people wearing gloves with sanitizing stuff. Bibles to be given out, and we're just going to offer to pray with anyone that would like to come to the table and to have a word of prayer. And then following that prayer, uh, we'll ask if they would be willing to let us show them how they could be saved. So I'm interested to see how we can turn this unique situation into an opportunity to do even more for God, not less. And I'm super excited that we don't have to meet up under an oak tree somewhere or in someone's backyard because we were still going to meet. But the governor has given us the, the opportunity to continue meeting in this uh, place of worship and actually calls it essential. So I hope to see you here, uh, either here in Orlando or in Jacksonville this coming Sunday. God bless.